Hello, this is Dr. Sahaja, a pulmonologist from Care Hospital, Sci-Tech City. Today, I wanted to speak a few words on the importance of giving up smoking. Uh, we also have a national day on May 31st as the International No Tobacco Day. So, I just wanted to highlight a few points about what are the hazards of smoking. So, smoking we know people start as a peer pressure or they also start looking at their parents and it's mostly started at around class 9, 10 when kids see their counterparts using it and they just want to try it out. So smoking we know can lead to a lot of diseases, it can lead to uh, strokes, it can lead to COPD which is chronic obstructive pulmonary disease which is a disease which is an irreversible process. So in this disease, uh, the patients will become progressively breathless and at one point of time, they are not able to even carry out their regular activities. And also it can cause a lot of cancers, not only of the lungs, but also of the mouth, of your food pipe, of your stomach, of bladders. In ladies, they, it can cause cancers of the cervix. And it's usually, uh, these are again irreversible, so it's no use repenting after that. So prevention is the key here. And we all know that diabetes and uh, tobacco and cigarette smoking is a very bad combination. So uh, I always tell my patients that diabetes always targets the end arteries, which are the small arteries. And tobacco also leaves its effect there. So combinedly, they can... Uh, each add to the effects of diabetes and tobacco and the result is really bad. We see very very young patients coming in with heart attacks and strokes because they are just smokers. So smoker is an independent risk factor for these kind of diseases. So and here rather than treating the consequences of tobacco and cigarette smoking uh, the, what we have to do is to prevent it. So prevent is only by stopping smoking if you are a smoker and not to start smoking under any kind of pressure if you are not smoking right now. Thank you.